Hey everybody, today we're going to attempt one of my favorite little projects. We're going to do some metal casting. We'll see. Uh, I have, this is part one, I'm building another furnace, but I just want to kind of nah, get back into it. Just uh, do something nice and easy. Today we're going to be doing some pewter. I want a nice, clean, pure uh, ingot. I haven't been able to get one that's not full of bubbles. So, check out the setup we're working with here. Now, if that ain't some high-class shit right there. One of the issues I had in the past casting ingots was my surface, I would put my molds on, not level. Looks like the mold needs to be cleaned. Gotta hit, hit that. Meanwhile, it's just gonna be fucking charcoal. It's pewter. It'll melt. It'll be fine. Uh, that's what we're after next. This isn't, you know, this, this setup's not gonna do it. I'm working on it. But let's see what we can do today. Ah, that's pretty. So, it's just gonna be a matter of time. I wanna get that big piece out of here, finally. Ah, very pretty. We got the good stuff, this is uh, Kingsford. Hmm, I wonder what's burning in there. Oh well. All right, after an absurdly long burn time, uh, I finally have a nice, shiny, cool metal. Time to slag it off. We won't be doing this again. Not on the grill. We're going to build something different tomorrow. I just wanted to have some fun tonight. Yikes, that is hot. Woohoo! See, I did buy this, this guy here. Try to get me the hell out of the way, but it's not as good at slagging. I really want a nice clean bar this time, so we're going to keep working it. Right. You notice I do have the mold preheating. Hopefully that will help as well. Oh, I'm going to get that black out of there. I think what we're looking at is surface oxides right now. Anyways, we'll take it down there. Yeah. Better than it was. What do you say? Get the, uh, the tongs out and we get ready to pour. I'm very excited. Wow, that's heavy. Oh, yeah. That looks awesome. I'm going to set that off. Hey, I got a grill. Cook out some dinner tonight. That looks outstanding. 
Uh, just wait for it to cool off a little bit and then pop it. Wow, I think that dude's hot. Holy shit. Again, it did, uh, like last time, it, it caves in the middle. I guess it just contracts. I have an idea of how to fix that, uh, but I just want to see if we can get a nice, clean, pretty bar. Uh, we'll let that uh, boil off a little bit. All right, you ready to see if we can pop it? Oh, I am liking that. Really, not a lot of, not a lot of uh, stuff going on the bottom. That would polish up nice. Some more water on that. That dude's still hot. Whew. Oh, that dude is heavy. It's got an interesting golden tone to it. Didn't expect that. But yeah, we got a decent bar this time. Well, I don't actually have a scale that goes up high enough to weigh it, but yeah, it's it's fucking substantial. It's pewter. It's a block of lead. Well, it's not lead. It's lead and tin, right? Uh, yeah, obviously. See, when the core cools, it contracts. The uh, the sides, little uh, convex, concave, right? So there was some, uh, wow, some debris on the bottom. I wonder if that came from the side of the pan as I, pour, as I poured. You see here, uh, the mold might not have been hot enough. It looks like this piece right here, the very thin layer of it, uh, solidified before the mass got poured. Uh, I would like to, I don't know. It'd be fun to try to polish it up, but decent looking bar as is I do not know what this black streak is that is a, a much better showing than I had before happy with that uh, we have more melting to come I have a great idea for tomorrow well kids the trail cams running I'll try and get that footage up uh, maybe tomorrow or Monday I don't fucking know decent decent fucking result for doing it on a barbecue grill uh, I wanted to actually just, you know, get a little bit of practice. I did buy the big, the big barbecue tongs, solid iron. So I wanted to, you know, at least do one pour to see how it was going to work with, with these. And yeah, that worked out pretty well. So I have some ideas for tomorrow. Stay tuned. We're going to have some more fun. Uh, you can always send me weird shit. P.O. Box 402. Bronson, Florida, 32621. Right now, I'm going to go have me a beer and uh, fondle my bar. Thanks for watching, everybody. Later. Hey, wait a minute. I forgot. I do have a scale that can do this. What's your guess? Really? Only three pounds even. That feels heavier than three pounds. That is surprising. I would have said five. There it is. Three pounds even. Very nice.